Hey, what's going on guys? Well, I want to do a specific video on the zombie apocalypse um, silver pieces. These are from monarchpreciousmetals.com. This is where I get a lot of my silver from. I like the company because they do such unique things, and this is a perfect example of that, of being unique and different. These are little tombstone, um, two ounce pieces of silver. Okay, they, they're the zombie apocalypse. Obviously, if we look at design here, we see the rest in peace because it's tombstone shaped. And the artwork on the front is the zombie hand, you know, reaching out of the clump of grass. Okay, it's supposed to be like in front of the tombstone. It's that classic scene you're going to see in a lot of the uh, old cheesy horror flicks and zombie movies. Um, we're all very familiar with it. It's super, super cool. These are individually serialized. This one's number 302. You see the Monarch Precious Metal stamp on the back. And as far as the size here, this might have been the stamp from like their quarter ounce uh, rounds. But super interesting, there's only 999 of these made, and on the site it says that they are no longer going to be made uh, ever again. So that's it, 999 in the entire world, and pff, they're gone. Um, on the website, when I'm filming this video, it said there was 269 left. By the time you guys see it, there'll be even less uh, available. So if this is something you're interested in, I would jump on it as soon as possible, okay? But stay tuned in this video because I want to talk a little bit about premiums and, and costs and stuff like that because not a lot of people are familiar with the premiums on, on silver. Basically, what it comes down to is a premium is the extra money you're spending on a specific type of silver because of the specific type of silver. In other words, if let's say silver is worth $20 a troy ounce, right? When you go to buy it, you're not necessarily going to pay $20 a troy ounce for an ounce of silver because there's always going to be a premium. Premium exists because of, you know, um, uniqueness of a product, uh, recognizability, right? Is such as the, the silver eagles are extremely recognizable. They're very sought after and collected because everyone knows what they are. So they carry a higher premium. You're not going to buy one for the exact spot price or the, the current uh, value of silver when you buy it you're going to pay a little bit extra um, this is no different because these are unique and they're limited they're going to carry a premium the premium on these are six dollars and 99 cents a troy ounce that's what it worked out mathematically so basically for every one ounce you're paying an extra seven bucks okay because of the fact it is what it is um, i love the fact that these are hand poured it's just beautiful i will take hand poured uh, bullion over you know, stamped rounds or coins any day. It's just unique. It, it truly is real treasure. And yeah, this is what treasure looks like. Um, it's just super cool. I like the fact that not everyone is the same. There's always going to be slight variants on it. Um, I love the raw look of it. It's just super, super cool. Two ounces, it's a heavy item. It's pretty dense. Um, you know, when you pick this up, it just, it feels good in your hand. It really does. It, this is treasure. And um, they're super, super cool. Like I said, I'd grab them as soon as possible if you are interested in them. But the something I want to discuss is that these do carry a little bit higher premium than some of the other things. For example, on their same site, you can get this same shape, okay, of a two ounce, a hand poured piece of bullion. Um, but without this artwork, it would just have, uh, you know, a simple uh, Monarch Precious Metals logo on there, say two troy ounces on the bottom. I'll put links in the description box to both of these. Now, the standard two ounce uh, poured piece only carries a dollar eighty-five premium, as opposed to these, which are very limited. They carry the six ninety-nine premium. So, in other words, you're going to pay less for the simple design of this, okay, as opposed to this, you know, special Halloween design. All right. So, if you're just buying silver for the fact for an investment purpose, you might not want to go with this. You might want to go with the other ones because it's only going to be, you know, about two dollars more than spot. Uh, and by the way, this is constantly fluctuating. In fact, when I got these. They were um, $48.58 each. Checking it today, they're $46.54 each, okay, because the, the price of silver went down a little bit since I got these. So, you know, it's constantly changing. It depends on, you know, what you want to do as far as when you're buying and when you're selling and stuff like that. But these specific designs, they're not going to last. I can tell you that right now. The, regardless of what spot is, and I think that at less than $17, as of the filming of this video, uh, silver spot is $16.28. If I had money to invest right now, I'd be buying hundreds of ounces of silver. That's just me. But if you want this specific design, you have to get it now. Otherwise, they're not going to be available anymore. But uh, I just thought they were super cool. That's why I'm kind of you know doing this video now. I wanted to hold off a little bit, but 
it's so limited I, I i have to show it to you now otherwise you'll be seeing the video and it'll be sold out um it's just super interesting they are uh 1.75 inches long and one inch wide and they're about 0.18 inches tall again not everyone is going to be alike they all have slight variants because they are you know handmade um to me these are the custom knife of the silver world you have you know regular coins everyone knows them of course the silver eagles and you know the list is very long of the you know traditional silver that's collected and to me those are like production knives right and this is like a custom knife to me it's unique it's different it's very limited and it's handmade and that's what i like about it so much it's special you know five ten years from now i can go up to anyone with a silver collection and there's a pretty good chance they won't have this so that's why I like these so much. That's why these stood out to me so much. And of course, because it's Halloween time, I mean, yesterday was Halloween, but um, you know, it stood out even more to me. Super, super cool piece. Highly, highly recommended. But if you don't get in on it now, they're not gonna be there for you. Uh, if you do happen to miss the boat on these, or if you're not buying just for collection purposes, and you do want to uh, pay the very least possible, but you like the idea of these um, two ounce round, or excuse me, two ounce uh, hand poured uh, bars, um, check out the other ones. It would be the second link in the description box, not the first one, but the one underneath it. Click on those, you see the design is very different, um, but it is even cheaper. Okay, so if you're purely into it for uh, the investment purpose, you, you're gonna wanna skip over the special stuff and the limited stuff and go right to cheap, 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 cheap silver, right? But either way, I would highly recommend any kind of hand poured bar or hand poured round that you can find. Uh, I, I just find them to be super unique and super cool and, and you know no different than knives i just love collecting different designs i like the, the look of different types of silver and uh this one just stood out to me as being extra cool so there it is that's the uh, the zombie apocalypse two ounce bar from monarch precious metals anyway that's pretty much it guys i just want to give you kind of a heads up uh, on these i'd be really surprised if they lasted a couple more days without being sold out if you missed the boat on this you're gonna have to wait for something else because they're never going to be uh, made again so Anyway, that's all. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have an awesome day. And uh, if you guys got some new silver lately, love to hear it down in the comments. Let me know what you got and what you paid for it. If you're, you know, so inclined to, to give that information out, uh, I love to hear everyone's deals. So hope you enjoy the rest of your day, guys. I'll see you soon. Take care.